In this lesson, we'll learn how to take the derivative of a function of a function using the chain rule. We'll build an intuitive picture first, then solve a model problem step by step. Think of composition, like two machines in a row. The input x goes into the inner machine g, which outputs a value we can call u. Then u goes into the outer machine f, producing the final y. Let's draw the flow x to g of x to u to f of u to y. Now imagine a tiny change in x. That change is multiplied by the rate of change of g at x to produce a tiny change in u. We call that g prime of x. Then that tiny change in u is multiplied by the rate of change of f at u to produce a tiny change in y. We call that f prime of u. This is the idea behind the chain rule. Multiply the two rates. If we divide both sides by the tiny change in x and let the change go to zero, we get the chain rule. dy dx equals d, y du times du dx. In function notation, that's f prime of g of x times g prime of x. Now, let's solve a model problem with clear steps. Find the derivative of y equals the square root of 3x squared plus 5x. Mm. Step 1, identify the inner and outer functions. Let u equal 3x squared plus 5x. The outer function is f of u equals the square root of u. Step 2, compute the derivatives of the inner and the outer. u prime equals 6x plus 5. f prime of u equals 1 over 2 square root of u. Step 3, assemble with the chain rule dy dx equals f prime of u times u prime. Step four, substitute back u equals 3x squared plus 5x and simplify. Here are two quick examples to reinforce the pattern. Example one, y equals open parenthesis 5x minus three close parenthesis to the fourth. The derivative is four times 5x minus three to the third times the derivative of the inside, which is five. That simplifies to 20 times 5x minus 3 to the third. Example 2, y equals sine of x squared. Outer derivative is cosine, evaluated at x squared, multiplied by the derivative of the inside, which is 2x. So y prime equals cosine of x squared times 2x. Summary. 1. Identify inner and outer. 2. Compute each derivative. 3. Multiply outer prime evaluated at the inner times inner prime. For substitute back and simplify. That's the chain rule for a function of a function.